Hi guys, Dan Stollers here. A very good evening to you all. I hope you're all well at home. Here we go then. We're going to get coin hunting. The first one of the day. £50 of 50p's. Can we find any commemoratives within? Fingers crossed that we can. One commemorative coin find I just brought back from work. If you haven't seen it, it will be in the previous video. And as always, with all of the videos on the channel, if you've been lucky enough to find any commemorative coin, no matter how common or rare you think that coin is, share it with us and together let's keep that dream alive that there's still some commemoratives out there in the wild it does look like we're going to hit though in this bag and we're going to start off with the platinum jubilee 50p coin 70 for 70 years of queen elizabeth ii being our monarch the crown royal cipher a stunner on the right hand side that coin Sorry, really sore throat. That coin was indeed one of three 50p coins to be released in 2022. Platinum Jubilee. We also had the Pride coin and the first Charles III 50p coin as well. Coin number two, the Tale of Peter Abbott, 2017. One of 13 different Beatrix Potters for UK circulation. It is actually the second most common in the set with 19.9 million being released. 9 million of this one was released, and this coin is the 1918 representation of the People's Act. Another coin which unfortunately is only worth its face value of 50 pence. But that does mean you do have more of a chance of finding them out there. Again, a lot of the common coins do get put back out into circulation. Unfortunately, you're not going to see many coins with super high overall values be put back out there. Again... If you're not a coin collector, you may well pick up a Kew Gardens and spend one, just like I did a few years ago. I say a few, it's probably must be six or seven years ago now. And I will never, ever forget it after I found out how much those coins were worth. And I think even back then, the Kew Gardens was around the £50 mark. It was really just over the last four years or so, that value of that coin really has skyrocketed it. Coins to definitely look out for, though, if you are wondering which coins may be worth more than the face values. Looking at Beatrix Potters, the Jemima Puddle Duck, in around the £10 mark. We've also got the Flopsy Bunny and the Peter Rabbit from 2018, £6 to £7. Mr. Titter Mouse on a nice move around the £5 mark. And again, we did predict that a few years ago. They were selling for around the £1.50. We bought a few hundred, sold them recently for around the £4. Not a bad investment at all. Next coin, Beatrix Potter Anniversary. Again, first of the 13 Beatrix Potter 50Ps to be released for UK circulation over the three years of the circulated coins. As always, at the end of the video, which we are nearly there, we find one more before the end. I will look through all of the coins again, look for any errors, any misprints. Sometimes while I'm talking along, I might even miss a commemorative. And if that is the case, you will see them at the start of the next coin hunt video another beatrix potter then to finish three beatrix potters then in this one coin hunt five in total we definitely have not done too bad at all the benjamin bunny rounds off the five most common 25 million being released so let's take a quick look at them all again tired sore throat so i do apologize for the videos this evening we have got the benjamin bunny the tale of peter rabbit the Beatrix Potter Anniversary, 1918 Representation of the People Act, and also the Platinum Jubilee. As always, please do hit your star find in the comments section below. And for me, it's going to be the Beatrix Potter Anniversary. Five from five bags. Not a bad way to start off the evening. Hope you enjoy the videos tonight. Stay safe and as always, guys, thanks for watching.